Yo, chat, can you hear me? Sorry, the Wi Fi box died. But I fixed it now. Oh, wow, it is packed up in here. Is this, is this the line for the beer? Don't tell me. Soccer, dude. Hold on, Square is just here. I know it's just What's that? Hold on, Square is just here. I know it's This is not the place? Yeah, it is, but it's not. We're not going to get there. Damn. All these $1 beer bars are fucking packed. We're not going to get... This is... The, bro, they do. Now, this is why people get stuck with the $5 beers, homie. What you mean? Everyone's watching fucking soccer, dude. Imagine, dude. Soccer. This place, you can't even see there's a bar from the outside. So it's always nice. And it's usually not full of people? It is, but it's big shit. It's wrong. It's kind of a student place. They have a bar, so you can just... Okay. Check it out. Yeah, you know, just anywhere. This is the good old old town, huh? The only place in Prague I've been. Because I, when I drove in to Prague in the motherfucking metro, I didn't see shit. A lot of fields, a lot of hills and shit. There wasn't nothing. And then it all comes all the time. That's what the guy yesterday said too when I spoke to weed. He's like, why are there so many Asians here? And I'm like, I don't know. I guess they just want to see, you know, the world. They want to get out of fucking Asia and see... The most them. obvious spice there is. You know, they all come in the same clothes and huge buses. And take pictures of everything. <laughs> what do you think they're doing? I mean, they probably have just... They don't have shit like this in, in Asia. So, you know, it makes sense. They want to see fucking Asia. Or they want to see Europe. It's like us Americans, you know? Imagine you had a, a bus full of Americans. Well, you never see Asians by themselves. That's the thing. Yeah, yeah, the Asians, they come in bus loads. They don't come in, like, one Asian at a time. <laughs> but I think it's because, like, in Asia, their, their type of culture is very, like, um, you know, in groups. Yeah, yeah. Like, group sort of things. But in, in America, it's not. So they're, they're probably too, too scared to travel by themselves. Or something, I don't know. Or maybe not, I don't know. What do you think, chat? They love tour groups, dude. <laughs> they do. Cool hands and again, can you help me out to Vienna? Yeah, bro, I'll get you to Vienna, bro. Let's go. <laughs> Motherfucking Chris Hansen dog, let's do it. Vienna is cool as shit, though. Better than Budapest? Budapest. Dude, this is I the... I mean, it also, are you go, if you're going to Chernobyl, then I would try to you know, find something on the way. This castle is the best thing in fucking Prague, dude. You're right, dude. There's groups of them. Uh, just groups. <laughs> <laughs> what? You see the left one is slimmer than the right one. Uh, the tower? Yeah. Is it? Why is that? I don't know, they probably fucked it up. <laughs> or they were just drunk, you know? Yeah, that would do. Yeah, I mean, I could barely even tell before you said it. But once you see it, you can't unsee it. I, I can't unsee it. Now you fucked it up for me, bro. I don't like Prague anymore. Oh, I need to take a fucking picture in front of this giant thing. Um, can you take a photo of me and then text or send me the... Do you have a Twitter? Uh, yeah. Or Instagram or something? Twitter, yeah. 
Yeah, can you take a photo and then send it to me? Of this castle. Because I haven't got a photo of Prague yet. I did get a nice refrigerator magnet, though. Chat, what's what's more famous about Prague? That that clock the or, clock, or yeah. this thing? Or, I mean, go, go. Is this thing, like, super... Take two pictures. But is this... I can only have one Instagram post. Not true. Is this... Chat, what do you think? The, the fucking... The clock or this tower? This castle thing? I feel like I've taken a bunch of... I've t I, half of my Instagram is full of, of towers and, and castles, dude. Maybe we do the clock. Let's switch it up. I feel like literally half of my Instagram is literally clock towers and fucking castles, dude. <laughs> Um, I mean, I want to go to Sweden. It's just kind of really out of the way. It's really far. All right. So they, the famous clock tower is over here. Every hour, it's like a cuckoo clock. Like a cuckoo comes out and like fucking does something, like rings the clock or something. We have yet to see that because we haven't been around on the hour. But it's not worth. It's not really a big deal. It's just a cuckoo that comes out like a fucking cuckoo clock. Here's the famous clocks. This is what my fridge magnet looks like. All right. This is Adrian Chen's door. All right. Let's see this. I took a bunch. Is, it the, is this the famous one, or is it not the one above it? I can try to get... Try to get both of them? I'll get it like a now. Yeah. Oh, perfect. Oh, that Let's looks amazing. Know. You want to send me this on Twitter? Yep. So this is What's your Twitter name? Uh, Fimo. No, Fimo was too short. The Fimo was too short. Fimo? Yeah. Do you want me to tweet it at you? Or? Uh, just uh, DM it to me. <laughs> it's a really nice fucking city, chat. I'll tell you what. Really pretty city. Where the hell are we taking this? What? Gang. It's a meat bar? Oh yeah, there's nobody here, you're right. This is neato. Hello. How much is a beer? Well, 35 pounds, 40 or 50. What's the difference? difference is the degrees because here is 10 degree here is 12 degree and the 14 degree which is uh, special just for now it's for St. Wences last day so the hotter the better yes or like more alcoholic it's uh, more alcoholic so if more alcoholic is better then harder is better <laughs> all right i'll get the cheapest one you have all right so the 10 degree is 35 i'm getting i'm buying a beer oh so yeah how, how much is the 14 that's 50 so yeah so Chat, 35 crown is like a dollar. It's like a dollar, dude. Oh my god, I'm sorry. Bro, imagine a dollar beer. Let's go. Pretty cheap. Maybe five together, fifty bucks for you, but give me 
But wait, how much? One. Is bro, if y'all would love it here, you get drunk every day, bro. Fucking five dollars. Let's go. Five dollars to get wasted. <laughs> They're playing fucking Rocket Man, dude. Do you know what the song is saying? Do you speak English? Yeah. Do you know what the song is saying? Uh, this song? Yeah. Does it sound good to you? You mean, what do you mean? The song, does it sound good? Yeah. Even if you don't know what the words are saying? I said, does the song sound good even if you don't know what the words are saying? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Interesting. Because I listen to, if I listen to Japanese rap, I don't know, if I don't know what the fuck he's saying, I can't listen to it. You can? No. When it sounds good? Even that one? Huh? No, even when it sounds good. I've been playing one Japanese song, and if you like it, or like... Yeah, play a Japanese song. Let's, let's see what you get. Is it rap? Okay, let's play some K, some J-pop, let's go. Okay. No, no, I want to, let's sit, let's sit inside and play some J-pop. Uh, like over here again? Uh, yeah, let's just sit at this table full of people. Hi, can we sit here? Okay, sorry. Sorry, I'm doing a live stream as well. Is that okay? Okay, I hope it just doesn't bother you. What's your names? Adela. Adela. Christina. Roman. Another Roman. Ika. We, our Uber driver was Roman. Our Uber driver was Roman. Uh, no, uh, yeah. <laughs> That's crazy. Y'all from Czech? Hey, what's up? So am I. <laughs> no, not really. No, no, not really. Paul. Plain and simple. P A U L Paul. I'm a stupid American. I know it. Where are you from? Uh, Vietnam. Vietnam, ah. Uh, what brings you to Czech? Uh, I was born here. Oh, okay. Well, that's good. I'm surprised you guys speak English. Surprised? Everybody. No one speaks English. I don't know. No one speaks fucking English around this motherfucker, dude. Really? I feel like no one speaks Czech around here. Really? Yeah. Whenever I go around, I never found someone who like, actually speaks Czech. Ahoy. No, that's not Czech. Ahoy. That's not Czech? Well, you can say that on a boat as well. So it's Ahoy. Yeah. 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 Let's try this one on there. Right? I'm from Texas. Texas, yeah. Gang. Gang shit. You know what gang shit means? What? Gang shit? Gang shit. Do you know what that means? Gang shit? Say it with me. Gang shit. Okay. You know what it means, though. Gang shit. Yeah, so it's all good. Yo, this beer is strong as fuck. It's strong as fuck, dude. This is the $2 one. You used to your fucking Bud Light. This definitely is not Bud Light, bro. What's this beer called? Ucha Untiki Pivo Bar? Pivo Bar? Bro. This thing's huge for one for like two dollars, bro. Bro, this is ridiculous. I know, it is fucking huge. Literally, you get wasted as fuck for like three dollars. Like what the fuck, homie? Like the shots are about the same price as the beer and the other thing. Bro, one dollar shots, what you mean? I think it is homemade. All the restaurants here have like breweries inside of them. You see like, you walk in, you see like a brewery inside the fucking restaurant. So they probably made this here. Yeah, probably. Well, no, I don't think they have brewery here. It's not my Either way, it tastes really, it tastes really good, like really fresh. 
but strong as fuck. 5% alcohol, is not bad. I'm not trying to repair these, no. I don't want to get wasted. I don't want to get fucking wasted right now. For no, for no reason to do that. <laughs> Munich beer is good. I would say that the beer in Czech is better than that you're taking first in. I appreciate that, homie. I would say the beer in Czech is better than Munich. Honestly. The Munich beer was good, but Czech, I don't know. It's cheap here. That's a, that's a good shit. Yeah, my jacket is fucking dirty. I don't know what this is. I don't know what. The, I look like a fucking homeless person. That's fine. Yeah, thank you for the beer, dude. I'm not staying until in Prague till Friday. Why are my hands all sticky? What is that? I'm staying in Prague just tonight. I'm leaving tomorrow. It's come. So did you decide where to go? I have to look it up. I'm thinking like uh, probably Krakow. But I gotta look it up and see. I would like. I mean, I would like to go to Chernobyl, but we'll see. And I don't really know yet. I want to go. I want to go sometime too. But it might be like hard to get there. I don't know. I hope they have a hotel near it and like a train. No, but you have to take a, like a taxi. Well, not a taxi, but you like, like a there's train. agencies where you uh, oh, like a bus. Yeah. Where you yeah. can find like a private guy and they'll let you do like they'll turn the other way if you want to do something. You want to what? Because if you go in a group. There is like strict rules. So you can find like a private guide so you can do more stupid shit. Why do I just go by myself? You won't take it in. Really? They only you in? There's like military checkpoints. Military checkpoints? Okay, that's not sounding too good for me. Oh man. Planning on visiting Rostislava and Slovakia. Probably not going to go to Slovakia, homie. <laughs> I don't see what the point. Or like, what's what's the Slovakia? What's the point? You'll die without an escort. You think so? I just I just hope Ukraine's not dangerous, dude. Like, I just hope there's not like military there that are gonna like shoot me if I fucking live stream or something. I don't like. I just hope that's not what's gonna happen. You have zero rights there, don't go. <laughs> are they gonna like arrest me if I go over there for no reason? Just because they're American. Will they? I don't know, I hope I don't get fucked up over there. <laughs> How's military being there less safe? Because they're in like civil war or something, dude. Maybe I'm wrong. What? Hong Kong. Hong Kong would be nice. Well, not right now. Oh yeah, they got a lot of protests going on there, but I wouldn't be part of the protest. I'll just leave the protest. They shot a guy yesterday. The police. They shot a guy? Point blank. For protesting? Yeah. Well, as long as I don't protest, I don't, I'm good. 
I trust Hong Kong more than Ukraine, bro. When I think of Ukraine, I think fucking weirdos. When I think Hong Kong, I think civilization and technology. Go to Japan. Japan is nice, yeah. Yeah, I went there twice. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I've been all over Japan. The only place in Japan I didn't go was Sapporo. Sapporo? I want to go to Sapporo. Where have you not been? I've been to like Thailand and shit. I mean, I've not been to a lot of places. The only Asian place I've been is ja uh, Japan. So you can do like a like a backpack. Yeah, I'll do a I'll do a fucking East Asian RV trip, bro. Get fucking robbed a million more times. Get a bike. Uh, yeah, right. I'll fucking die. <laughs> And when you think Prague, you think big clock? Yo, know, when I think Prague, I think beer, clock. That's what I think of, about Prague. Old people. It, I thought it was, originally when I came here it was partying and sex and shit. Not anymore. Now it's like old people, clocks, and beer. What do I think about Czech girls? I mean, the Czech girls aren't bad looking, I mean, if that's what you're implying. I mean, I don't look at them like that because I have a girlfriend, but they're, you know, definitely not ugly. I'll put it that way. Ask people about 69 if you think Do you know who 69 is? 69? Who it is? 69, the rapper? No. Te yeah, Takashi 69. You know him. Do you guys know Takashi 69? Somebody told me that 6ix9ine is huge in Czech Republic. I don't know, dude. As you can see, he isn't. I can't see 6ix9ine being huge in the Czech Republic, dude. Do you guys know Tupac? Yeah. Do you know Tupac? George Washington. Martin Luther King. <laughs> what did he do? Martin Luther King? No. George Washington. Yeah, he had wooden teeth. He had wooden teeth. Yeah. He never lied. Yeah, some crazy shit. And then Martin Luther King. Yeah. Do you guys know Malcolm X? Yeah. Look up Cindy Hazan in attachment theory psychology PDF as spread the word dies. Romantic love conceptualized as an attachment theory. You kind of look like my friend. <laughs> <laughs> no, she's from France. She's a model. Oh, not <laughs> No, I think no. You look just like her. Really? She's a Playboy model. Okay. No, I'm serious. So, is the university one be okay for me? <laughs> Should what? Well, um, I'm on the freshman year. Freshman year on the university here. So if it would work, then I can be playing model. Right? What do you mean? Okay. Univer university, university's college around here, right? Yeah. yeah. So what's, what's, what's she, she, she's, what's she's trying to say is that if uh, she her, her studies don't go well, oh, then she yeah. can be in the university. Hey, 
my friend, her name's Marie, she's a millionaire. Really? Yeah, she's got 50 billion shekels, or shecks, or whatever it's called around here. It's called, it's called Krona. She got 50 billion Krona. Billion with a B, Krona. That's, that's crazy, and it ain't that a thing. You too. Are you like so you are a YouTuber? Yes. Famous YouTuber? Yes. 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 Uh, what's your question? <laughs> I like to look on the street. Ice Poseidon. Ice Poseidon. What do you do? Do I do what? Pop wizards. Pop? Pop? Pop. Like, what do you do on your channel? Tell it. I do nothing. You do nothing. That's interesting. I do nothing and it just, it, it works out. <laughs> I, I literally do nothing. What have I done? I walk, I, wa I, I walk, I, I walk to the park and I play RuneScape, yeah. So you do games? <laughs> yeah. And I walk to the park and go to the Eiffel Tower and complain that there's not a higher view. I'm also an alcoholic and I get paid money to drink alcohol. No, it's a great job, actually. <laughs> no, it's not because I'm gonna lose my leg. What? I'm gonna lose my leg. <laughs> Why? I'm just kidding, dude. Never mind. Right? Just what? Just You're gonna lose your leg. Yeah. <laughs> Hi, I say I'm trying to gather data for a report and want data from as many countries as possible. Can you please ask everyone at the table if they have either given or received anal activity? I think I'm going to run. <laughs> Wait, how old are you guys? I'm 19. Not too old for drugs. <laughs> 19. All right. I'm, I'm going to ask you a really fucked up question. Somebody gave me $5 to tell you. Are you guys ready? Do you get offended easily? It's not gonna offend you, right? Do people in the Czech Republic uh, give or receive anal? No. <laughs> Is not a thing. I would totally give anal. So, I mean, I guess in America it's different. Well, the trick is to relate to anal, I think. Czech's not into anal? No. Why not? You like anal? It works. What do you mean, dog? It works. It's a, if it works, yeah? What you mean? Yeah, I mean, hey, listen. I receive, I take, I give, I don't give a fuck. It's not a thing here. Wow. That's really that's crazy. Like even for guys, like most guys don't even like want to try it. Really? Yeah. Dude, I've given it and I've taken it. <laughs> yeah, my roommate. My, my roommate. His name was Voldasad. My roommate. <laughs> Yo, you know Voldasad, bro. He had a fucking dildo and he shoved it up my ass. I swear to God, I promise you. No fucking lube, nothing. Try. I just, what? No, it sucked. But you know, but you know what? I still did it though. Nah, my girlfriend don't peg me. What you talking about? <laughs> Sorry, is that a weird question? No. <laughs> Sorry, somebody gave me five dollars to say that, so I just had to say it. He paid for a beer. Uh, yeah, he paid for my beer, so I just had. No, sorry, he gave me three dollars. That's how low I am. I take, <laughs> I do anything for three dollars. Okay, sorry. All right, but what it do though? What it do? What it do? What it what? What it do? Do? do. Like what it do? You know what it do? What it do? 
What did do? What what did do? You know you're not you're not supposed to answer. Just what Look up schema therapy psychology on Google. Also, it will bring us together to understand <laughs> each other. Like what's up? Yeah, it's like what it do? What's up? What it do? <laughs> yo yo yo, Darius, how does it feel now that IP one and IP two are banned? Is this the final nail in the coffin for your streaming career? Are you gonna make a replacement for him? No, maybe one day, but not right now, currently, dude. And I don't need Reddit, so it's all good, bro. Thank you, dog. I appreciate that, homie. Okay, schema therapy psychology on Google will bring us together. I don't know what that means, but thank you, homie. Guy. Yo, where the J-pop at? Well, I was waiting for you. <laughs> but here I am. Let's go. You like it, bro? I love, I love it, homie. You tall as a motherfucker. What's up, bro? They're playing some Vice City music. You know GTA Vice City? Bro, this shit is from that fucking Flash FM radio station, homie. Okay. On YouTube? Oh, uh, no, on YouTube, homie. Yeah. Yeah. Did you get better? Yeah. These things happen, dude. Hi from the Hiding in My Room fan community. Keep up the cool streams. Ice cheers. I knew you are because you have Japanese lettering. I, thank you. You got another one. Shit, I might have to get another one too. I should get another one. I gotta finish my other one first. What the fuck is this thing? What is a UFO? What is that? What are these? It's like a eatable paper and inside is a sour powder. Can I have this? <laughs> Five crafts like fucking half a dollar or half a penny, dude. Yeah, like, so it's like free, dude. It's like basically. All right, here you go. No, that's a two. Two, four, one more crown. Uh, come on, G. I don't got no one crowns up in this motherfucker, dude. That's not even money. <laughs> At that point, that's like a micro atom or something, dude. Here you go. Or who takes this five? All right, cool. You want the four crowns? Which color would you like? Uh, green. Color? Green's always pretty sour. Oh, gang. It's so it's paper? Yeah, it's a little bit of paper and it's actually like powder. Oh, this is good. Oh. This ain't shit, Bob. Wow, dude, I just, paid, I just paid no money for this thing that I just already ate. Five crown? What is five crown worth in, in dollar? Literally, like, not even a penny. <laughs> it's, it's, it's like free. <laughs> 20 cents. I don't know, dude. I got. I think I have a one crown coin. What the fuck is one crown? What, what, how much is one crown in dollar? Point zero 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 one penny. I have no idea what I just ate. He told me I ate paper, dude. I literally just ate. Fuck! I just paid to eat paper. No, I don't think so. There's no, there's no reason to go to RuneFest. 
I don't, uh, all the, all the mods, all the J mods that I like quit. I don't, I don't stream on Twitch, so I don't fit in. Oh, fuck yeah. She's my new friend. She's my new friend. Yours? Yeah, she's my friend. I'll show even the even the video clip for it. Oh, you guys are on YouTube, huh? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Not really working. What the fuck is this? Oh, gang shit! Gang! What's that? What's that? What? I said it's J pop, Japanese pop. J pop. Hey, Danki Geska. Hey, Konnichiwa, let's go. I speak Japanese, what's up? Gang. Maybe they do like some words in English. Fantastic baby. Oh. Mm. Oh shit. There we go. Hey. Hey, I'll just That's fucked sorry, up man. on this one dollar beer, bro. Let's go. <laughs> Good to see you, man. Oh, nice to see you, bro. I've been watching your streams for a while. I've never, like, been able to, like, I can't even fucking speak right now, man. I'm so, like, this is cool, man. Can I buy you a beer? Sure, yeah. One dollar beer. Let's go. Fucking free dollar beer. Let's go. I'm getting fucked up up in this hoe. Let's do it. I'm from Florida, too, man. No, you're not. Yeah. What are you doing in Czech? I live here, man. For Hey, what part of Florida? Central Florida. I don't want to say where I'm from. Okeechobee or some shit? Not close. Come on, Okeechobee, dog. Wait, what are you, why are you in check, though? Uh, I came here as a student, and then I really liked it, so I decided to stay. Hell yeah, Why'd dude. Why did you decide to come here? I don't know, because I'm streaming. Yeah. Just a stream, you know? How's it been so far? I was watching a little bit, and it seems like it's kind of dead, right? Bro, it's boring as fuck here. Boring as fuck in this motherfucker, dude. <laughs> but that's fine. I fuck with it. What's the most exciting thing you've done so far? Uh, drink this beer, listen to J-pop. Here you go, man. Thank you, dude. Happy late birthday, by the way. Oh, thank you, homie. What's your name? Mike. Mike, nice to see you, bro. Come sit over here with us. Yeah, sit down. Uh, we pay our salaries. I'm sorry. We pay salaries. So we are in charge of, you know, like, Two dollars. Two dollars. I'm from. Nice to meet you. You know him? Uh, Alright, I'm Nesquid. Yeah. You know him? From what? From the Steelers, yeah. I'm not from Florida, but I don't know. Florida. Do you speak Czech? A little bit. Do you live here? Yeah. I'm saying some Czech. I mean, you're Czech, you can, you can test me and see how good it is, you know? Okay, try something. Hell yeah. What's the mod say? You think we? You think these guys speak fucking Czech in the chat? Come on. Bro, you're literally, you're literally like a spy, bro. You're like an American spy over here in Czech Republic, dude. No, it was How do you speak Czech? They said. I have little flashcards, you know, like with some words on it. What about Duolingo? Yeah, I use that, I use that too. Hey, Duolingo. What the fuck is Ebonics? Like, isn't that kind of how you speak anyway? What is that? What is Ebonics? Ask, ask, does chat know what Ebonics what, what, is? What is that? Like, I think I mean, like... I think you know, I think everyone knows what it is. Like, like Ebony? No, no, you know, it's like, you know there's American accent, 
you know, like maybe there's like, you know, like some Texas accent. What does a Texas accent sound like? Oh, howdy, y'all. Let's go lasso up some cow and shit. I don't know, something like that. So, oh, it's, it's like it's like ghetto speak? No, it's not. Yeah, that's, that's exactly what you're saying. No, that's, that's so racist, dude. It's like, it's Ebonics. No, it's a that's not ghetto speak, that's just how... You know. It's totally, it's totally, I, yeah, it sounds racist if I explain it, but it's not racist. You can study Ebonics in, in university, it's totally... Bro, what do you mean? You can study how to talk like a hood motherfucker in university? Nah, there's like different grammatical I did this shit for free, no university, I can speak hood as fuck. <laughs> sorry, sorry, I'm speaking hood over here, sorry. Yeah, it's a little... People, people love that shit here, right? Uh, uh, I think like... Probably like the stereotype of thing is like we're probably more loud than usual. And then if you're streaming, it's probably double that. It's oh yeah, dude. When I'm streaming, just dude, I'm all over the place. When they clutch their purses, when they hurt that, no, dude. What do you mean? Yeah, yeah. Well, like, what do you think of Czech people so far? What's the stereotype? Uh, you can be offended, I guess. Uh, <laughs> I think the Czech people are, I don't know, just normal, like Russians or something. Oh, there you go. That's, that's the... <laughs> Why, is that like, you don't, you don't say that here? It's not even, you don't even say it's like the East, though. It's not East. It's like what? Canadians and Americans. I'm not offended. Really? No, I why would I be offended? If you call me Canadian, I'll laugh. I'll be like, oh, I'm Canadian. No. <laughs> yeah, it's the same thing. But if I call you guys Russians, it's offensive? It's be, not. I shouldn't be offensive. My grandma is from Ukraine. But it's not Russia. I feel like it's a big difference between Russia and Ukraine. <laughs> There's more history there behind it. Yeah. Oh yeah, I guess it makes sense. The Russians have invaded you guys. So that's why you don't want to be called a Russian. Yeah. Uh, but I mean, low key though, the Czech language is pretty Russian. Like low key. Like low key. Like it's, it's super Russian, isn't it? Do you go to visit them? I don't know, isn't it? Super low key, yeah. Like low key. Czech, Czech is like Russian, dude. <laughs> like if I didn't know, I would think you guys are speaking Russian. It sounds Russian. Yeah, but I think if you hear it side by side, you would definitely be able to tell the difference. Maybe. I mean, I'm an American. I don't even. I didn't even know Czech existed before Spider Man. Yo, you know, I didn't know that Czech Republic existed before Spider Man. Oh, thank you very much. Did you guys see the Spider Man movie? Yeah, we have. Where we they went to Prague. Yeah. Yo, that's some crazy shit, dude. I didn't even know that. I didn't even know Prague existed before yeah. the Spider-Man movie, dog. That's crazy. It's kind of funny because they uh, told us that people are over there. I have a present for you, by the way. I want you to guess what it is. I don't know. I mean, it could be anything. It's not good. It could be anything. It's legal. It's not, it's not dangerous. Anymore. Is it weed? It, oh, that's not the present, but... <laughs> is, it, just, is, is it a jewel? No. Okay. Fuck, god damn it, dude. Who has a fucking jewel around here? There's a, there's a possibility you could guess. What, what do you, yeah, what are, what are the... Give me a... Give, give your, put your... Uh, it's Mexican Andes right here. <laughs> dude, give me a hint. Um... Is it Kinder Egg? You can, you can use it. It's something that's practical. Like, you can use it. Is it a new phone? No. Fuck. Okay. No, like, let's say it's maybe like 0.01% of the cost of a phone. Like, nowhere near as expensive as a phone. But you could argue it's just as useful. Someone says a flashlight. It's not a flashlight. I mean, something. I don't know. It could be anything, homie. To be fair, is that a knife? No, no. I'll, I know you like, uh, you said you like guns, right? <laughs> yeah, I mean, I fuck with guns. What's it, what it what be? It's like, it's like a BB gun or something? Oh, this is like super chill. Like a real ass gun? <laughs> Look. <laughs> <laughs> what, what is that? What, everyone's laughing. What the fuck is that? Bread in a cup? It's in a glass, man. It's a glass. I don't get it. 
It's like a Is this like a, it's a check souvenir, man? It, it's like a joke or something? No. I don't know, it's like bread in a cup. You'll see people having like 20 of these very in bags. Common here. Yeah. What do you mean? Why do they put bread you in a cup? You see people walking around with glasses full of bread? No. No, it's totally like you Why? Now, now you're check, you have that. Why what does it mean though? <laughs> it's just a thing? Yeah, yeah, do I eat the bread? No, just leave it there and like and have it as a decoration. How is this practical? Well, you, what you the fuck the am I going to use hungry. this for? You can eat the bread when you're hungry and you can use the glass when you're thirsty, but you have to like put... Uh, bro, I'm not... This shit's stale as fuck. What are you talking about? Shit. Bro, this shit's like a hard... This shit hard as fuck. What you mean? The bread doesn't spill. It's okay. It's that, like, uh, oh, yeah. That, you can hold it. Like there you go. Dude, there's some good... But I noticed that this bread doesn't get as moldy as quickly as like normal loaves. Bro, how old is this bread? After three days, the loaf of bread is all blue, but this, this can last for a while. But it's, it's really hard. Bro, it smells like shit. How old is this bread? Is it? I mean, I mean, let's open it. That is pretty stale, but there's no color, you know? Bro, it's stale as a motherfucker. Right, bro, you're crazy. That shit's gross. Try it. I'm not, dude, that's some stale ass bread. That's a piece of fucking bread. That gonna get me sick as fuck. You can dip it in beer first. No, I'm not dipping this stale ass bread in some, some fucking beer, dude. Some one dollar beer, you're gonna be fucked up. It kinda tastes like I'm chewing a piece of rubber. <laughs> Yeah. I would think so. I want to spit this out, but now that I've broken it, I have to eat it. Is that part? Oh, dude. It doesn't taste bad, it's just chewy. Well, well that, thank you. Alright, All right. I'll, I'll taste the, the disgusting bread. Alright, let's see. It's a lot, like you're not going to chew it all. I'm not going to eat all of it. <laughs> and there's like vitamins and shit in there too, man, to keep it healthy. I can't, like, I can't chew it. Dude, it hurts. <laughs> you guys want some bread? Yeah, I can't, can I take Yeah, you guys want some bread? <laughs> yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll join you. Maybe like a small piece, because now we, now we pop the cherry up here. Okay, that's some good bread right there. And you can, if you if you want to smash this, you can do it, but you have to find a safe place. Like, don't do it in old town. Smash, like the glass? Yeah, I used to do it. Uh, Why do you smash the glass? I used to do it a lot. <laughs> like, every week. You know? No, like, it was a bad habit. I would want to take a glass home with me, and then I would change my mind halfway home, and then I would just, like, punt it down the street. I would just... Try being grateful bread won't get you sick, and when you run out of money, you can eat the bread. Bro, the bread's gonna get all fucking stale in my bag, what you mean? <laughs> hey dude of cool time in Prague, smiley face. Thank, thank you, B. Thank you, Sir Random. I appreciate that. Do you guys live here? Like, students, so we have yeah. some different Are you all together? Like, you're studying together? Oh, you're, 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 so what are you guys majoring in? What are you majoring in? What are you majoring in? Oh, Sorry. Oh, social sciences? What is that? What is a social scientist? Uh, well, it's, <laughs> um, for example, the cooperation between states. Like politics. Ah, uh, so you want to be like a prime minister? No. <laughs> no, we really don't. Why not? Um, I don't believe. I think you could be a good prime minister. Well, if you say integral public, you could be the first woman prime minister. <laughs> prime minister, integral public, it's like a bad word. And of course, we what don't you like uh, our prime ministers. Yes, uh, you guys don't like them? Uh, no, really. And everyone like, yeah, the club right, here. And he was, he was the club. No, no, no. Uh, everything. I didn't know. You never it's, heard of Chapo Room? Actually, you know? You know. You know. What do you mean? Oh, Y'all got a fucked up prime minister. I know. <laughs> it is. Why are Kinder eggs banned in the US? What do you mean? Because the little babies choke on them. There's plastic inside. Really? Like in the Happy Meal, you get the plastic toy, but they put it in the egg. 
So imagine if you're a little baby and you just eat the whole egg, you like choke on the plastic yeah. sheet. So I think it's like more illegal than uh, like drugs or whatever. Dude, what the fuck? <laughs> Kinder eggs are more illegal than drugs. That sounds like something. Maybe not. I mean, it's kind of exactly. Yeah, so I don't think they like it. Have any of you guys come before? Big fucking cocks. Don't ask that dumb shit. What the fuck's wrong with you, bro? Don't say that stupid shit. Vaping cum? No, shut the fuck up, homie. How many people were there? I'm not having no four stuff after this. What are you talking about, dog? It was the whole like uh, the trams. I don't know, but in I gotta finish this beer. Which one's better? I think this one's better. It's not as strong. Which one? The 10 one or the 12? Yeah, I, I, the other one, this one's really strong, you know? So I think there's going to be something, some demonstration of the different part of the way. Another one, another one, another one. And you know they closed by the There's like some reconstruction. Yeah, so you can't even go to the next car. Yeah, maybe it's Stalin? Yeah. Because there's closed? a bar under it, and it's really old, and they haven't done reconstruction, I think, since it's been opened. So it's been condemned. And even the place where all the skaters go, like, it's there's barricades, there's guards. So they're going to close it forever, or...? The last I heard was, unless they make a, a reconstruction, it's, like, totally closed. But they're closing for the season anyway, right? So they can just renovate their own... Place. Yeah, but you can't even walk up on top of them. So without the bar, just anywhere in that area, it's forbidden. Yeah, and there was this uh, petition to keep it. I think it's past though, it's, it's already gone. That would have been a cool place to go. It's the metronome at nighttime. That's like the best. What is that? It's only an American baby would try to devour an entire kind of egg in one go. That's how they raise their kids. You babies wouldn't do that. Hence why our babies don't choke on kinder eggs. Yeah, I was like, yeah, American babies are dumb as fuck. 1948. They tore it down and they had a bunch of these different things there. And then the last thing they had was a metronome, like literally like, like a metronome for like a piano. And uh, yeah, that's so it's called Stalin for skaters. It's like a big skate spot, but you can go there at night, have a beer, look at the city. Like you can see where we are, Old Town, all the lights. Like, they always have like out open air parties, and this is internationally famous skate spot. Yeah, yeah. Like, it's really fun. Gang. Does anyone know when you say gang shit? Has anyone reciprocated like gang shit since you've been here? You did it. No. Yeah, he cheers, knows it. Cheers, cheers. <laughs> no, these guys don't know it. Gang shit. Gang. Exactly. Gang, yes. gang shit. Gangity shit. How do you explain it? Have you explained to people? Gang shit means good shit. Okay. It means good. Gang shit. Good. So, so this is this, hey, hey, $1 beer, gang shit. <laughs> <laughs> Something like that, yeah. <laughs> How long have you been streaming? Like today? Uh, I've been streaming since like four. It's so like five hours. How long do you plan on going? Because you're going, you're leaving tomorrow. Yeah, I'm probably going to uh, not go too much longer. Adela. Ice, how long are you staying in Prague? Will you still be there on Friday? Hold me any chance to catch you off stream too. I am going to be leaving Prague tomorrow to go to Krakow, Poland. So if you want to see me in Prague, you should probably make it out tonight. Otherwise, we're going to Krakow. You been there? I was there like a month ago. It's going be really warmer What's so good about it? Well, in, yeah, it's going to be different if you're streaming because the spring comes we earlier like, as well. It's underground, so I don't know. Oh, like, it was, like, when it was 20 degrees here, there, so like, well, then it's like 13. 100 meters underground. I really, I really doubt there's going to be Wi-Fi right? or any data, so it's streaming like, probably not good. But Krakow is like really easy to walk around. But last summer we didn't have, I think we had two days of rain last summer. But the problem is that a lot of people are underground, even in Prague. There was a catastrophe for the farmers to do anything. No. <laughs> Damn, so I'm gonna go and there's not gonna be shit to do in Krakow because it's all underground. Well, you're, you're going tomorrow, so that, wait, tomorrow's Thursday. So, if you're gonna be there for like Friday or Saturday, I think it'll be pretty lively, but um, 
most of the clubs and stuff, it's kind of underground. Most of the places you have to go. Well, that's not good. Have to know. Well, you have to make make the content, man. You gotta like. Uh, Bro, but if it's all underground, though, what you mean? I'll be freezing my butt off in fucking the streets. Talk somewhere. to homeless people on the street. There's oh no, yeah, I'm gonna go to Poland no and talk to homeless people. That's dude. what I'm saying. So it's like for you as an individual to go, it's cool. But if you're, yeah, if you need Wi-Fi and shit, I don't know how much of it you can stream. Bro, I'm not gonna go all the way to Poland to go talk to some homeless ass motherfucking people, dude. What are you talking about? I can do that shit in LA, bro. Like, I guess I could be kind of ambiguous. Like, do I look like I could be. Could I, could I be checked? If I didn't speak English and you just looked at me, yeah. See, I think I could kind of fit in, you know, in general. Could I? I should be a spy. You look really sweet. Yeah. <laughs> but I mean, there's bump checks as well. What, what about me? Could I be checked though? I could be checked. What's up? Ahoy. What do you mean? I don't look Czech enough for you? How do you know? But how, how do I look American? <laughs> Loud. Come on, what do you mean? You said he he's American too, but he looked Czech. Yeah. I don't know. He's more nice. More nice? <laughs> what? Am I not This nice? guy has no idea what he's talking about. There are like two tourist attractions which are underground. Nothing else is underground. Stop taking advice from idiot Americans. Wow. You don't look like Czech. But why? You're like too dark skin. Sorry. Too dark skin? Yeah. What do you mean too dark skin? My skin, I'm white as fuck. Yeah. You mean, I'm, I'm whiter than you guys. <laughs> what? Bruh, no, I'm whiter than you guys. What do you mean? Oh, well, not that, not this guy, but bruh, what you mean? Homie, okay, where do y'all think I would be from then? Hey, Italy, I like you. Romania. Romanian, bro. Get out of here. Yeah. You call me Romanian? <laughs> bro, how the fuck do I look Romanian? I mean, what you mean, dog? You got the hair. The hair. I think that. that pulls aren't the Romanians hair. white as fuck, though? Yeah. Um, aren't Romanians super white, though? No, no, dark eyes. Really? Dark eyes. Those are like gypsies. Not damn, I'm a. Damn, I'm just. He could be a gypsy. Yeah, he could be a gypsy. Yeah, let's see how you're a gypsy. Is that, is that not a racist word? A little bit. It's a little racist, uh, yeah. But Tikan, Tikan is. Damn, I'm just. You also white. Like something else. All right, I need to go to the Middle East then, so I can have people call me white. This is ridiculous. <laughs> if I went to the Middle East, they'll call me white, so I need to go there. That's ridiculous. I am not Romanian. I am from America. Romanian. I am Italian. What do you mean? <laughs> I said Romanian. I'm not Romanian. I'm from Ita I'm Italian. Bulgaria. No. Bulgaria? No. Bulgaria? Dude, you're just pissing me off. Bulgaria, dude. Yank gang. Can you do Italian? I can look like a guy that's so stupid. Can you do Italian? I look like what? Like the guy that sells give up in here. The guy who sells drugs? Give up. What the fuck is that? It's, it's it's kebab. Kebab. Oh, I sell kebabs? <laughs> Come on, bro. What you mean, homie? I'll sell kebabs, homie. What you talking about? It's a good about? living. It's an honest living. Brian sell no. I ain't trying to sell no kebabs for a living. Have you, ever, have you ever made a kebab? What? Have you ever made a kebab? No, nah, dude. Oh. I don't want to make no. I'm what am I from Alka Harrod, homie. Come on, what you talking about? Yank gang, thank you. It should be a genetic gift. I think you have the ability. I think if you tried, you would be super good at it. Bro, kebab gang, let's go. <laughs> I'm over here. Hey, hey. Hey, y'all want some kebabs? What's up? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, I got bread in I just got, I got this fucking bread in a glass instead, bro. You can use it for your kebab. I know. <laughs> But the thing is, is you find one really good place, and then after a while, I think the quality gets lower. Like if there's a new kebab place, please tell me of a good kebab place. place. Just type in Luke. Are you familiar with like? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, I know. So if you take uh, towards Lipanska, mm -hmm. like Lipanska and Husinitska, there's like it's like kebab king, I think it's called. There's a church right in front of it, directly across. There's a kebab. Because the kebabs in Sweden are fucking amazing. Yeah, I was in, in Stockholm over there. Yeah, I think it's a good one. Yeah, but you have to go to Malmo to get the good kebabs. 
Because that's where the most Arabs are. That's where you have to go. No, what's the place? Gamostan? Big like the hipster. Uh, Sarama. Yeah. 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 There's a dangerous spot over there. There's a square right when you take that bridge. Dangerous? Gamostan. Yeah, I saw like. Uh, do you know? Do you know what it's called? In, in Su Su Sudan, uh, there's a big square on the main street, and there's like always police. I'm not from Stockholm, so I'm not too okay. sure. But I think I, I just assume you know every single city yeah, that's in the whole country. Yeah. I know Malmo. So Malmo, that's, that's, that's like the hood, man. Yeah, that's the hood. Where is no, it? What Malmo. are you talking? Malmo. Where? Where? In, in Sweden. Oh fuck Sweden. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, homie. I heard nah, some. I heard some bad things about Stockholm. How about what do you hear? I hear that Stockholm is shit. Well, if you're gonna visit Sweden, Stockholm is probably your best bet. Really? I think so. People told me it's not a good place. It's like or ghetto. Either Stockholm or Gothenburg. Malmo is pretty boring. Not much to do. Where should I? So you say I should go to Stockholm? Yeah, or Gothenburg. They said it was really bad there. Where? In yeah. Stockholm. It depends on where you go. They said it's like not safe. I mean, you, now you're in Prague and you've only been in Prague once, so if you go to Stockholm, I don't think you're gonna go to the bad area. You're, you're gonna go, uh, yeah, I'll just stay in like Stockholm you're gonna, 1. You're just gonna stay, yeah, Stockholm 1. But there's only one spot. Not Stockholm 2. Yeah, we should. We should, uh, I'm gonna, we should go from this place. <laughs> I, I'm pretty like feeling pretty ridiculous at the moment. How long are you gonna speak? I don't know. Uh, yeah, I mean, I, I mean, I'm pretty. I'm finishing it. I'm pretty good. You can speak English if you want. Yeah, yeah. No, like you started with RuneScape. I was trying to tell them. Like, like, you don't really use I do know when they don't. Like, they don't. Like, you can run some different public. Hey, RuneScape number one, let's go. Ultimate Iron Man gang, baby, let's do it. <laughs> you don't play it, but EHP, let's do it. Dude, I dropped my whole bank like three days ago. I'm addicted, man. Anyone that was in, why I think it was World. Why'd you drop your bank? Because I'm addicted and I need to get off. I, I dropped my fire cape, I dropped all of my uh, uh like, like shutting down. No. Dude, it's bigger than ever, man. Bro, it's on mo it's on mobile? What you talking about? Shutting down, it has homie. It's never been bigger than it is right now. I would say check it out, but it like it consumes your life. Like, if you take it seriously, it consumes your life. I've been playing League of Legends, so I know what, yeah. it, like, what it is to like go to battle. The thing is, like, I was never even that good at it, but I just spent all my time on there. Bro, I'm an ultimate Iron Man. I got a dragon dagger, and I got a fucking dragon scimitar. Yeah. I got a fire cape on that bitch, so let's go. Ultimate yeah. Iron Man level 80, let's go! You got a fire cape on there? Really? Okay. <laughs> no. I but I got right. all the I got all the supplies for a fire cape. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I just haven't done it because I'm scared. Do you watch any of their uh, like Ultimate Iron Man YouTuber guys? Or... Yeah. You know Verf? Swamp Athletics and Lil oh, yeah, yeah. and Lil Verf. Because Verf. Oh no, had... Ultimate Iron Man Verf. Yeah, and a guy on who's on Karamja, and I know the other dude. I forgot what's his name. Fucking yeah. Lil 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 Mudkip. Yeah, yeah. Yo, yeah. Mudkip's my dog. He's He's on the up and up right now. Man. Yo, he's he is. Be, I think once settled, he's settled is still peaking. He hasn't peaked yet. But once he does Theater of Blood, I think Mudkip has a chance to kind of take over. Bro, Mudkip ain't taking over Swamp Lennox. You crazy. No, after, at, there, there was the A Friend era. Now we're in the Settled era. And I think after, after uh, Settled, it's kind of open territory, you know? And I like watching DVS too, but I think he's really good at, at progress videos, but I don't think he has that extra thing to make him like, everyone's gonna watch. Who, Mudcap? DVS. Oh, DVS, yeah, DVS him. Uh, he's all right. No, he's, no, he's good. There's nothing wrong with him. I'm just saying, it's like, I don't think he has the same level of like people fucking waiting a month to watch. Nah, because he's video. he's too nerdy. Well, he's gonna be was at the first one every single Iron Man mode, and I, I forgot what his total level is right now. But I, like that's that's a pretty big accomplishment, you know. It's like it was how many hours is that, man? It's like uh, all together he's already it's like three thousand or four thousand for the first one, and I played yeah, I don't know, man. 
Which sim? Which sim? I like you though. You know a lot of shit, bro. Yo, yo. I'm just like, I'm st I'm not as nervous as before. You've been watching since first 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 I, No, no, no. I started watching. I remember. Uh, I started watching when I was here. But when you had, um, what, was, what was the guy? Uh, yeah, it's Smeet. Yeah. The OT or Genesis when you had that that uh that theme song from the beginning. Okay. Like I'm in love with the moose meat. So that's when you started. That was when I first saw you. And then from there I was always watching, but I never really had a chance to watch the live streams as they were happening. So it's more just like the highlights here and there. But yeah, man, like I used to just sit there and have a text from mom. I think you texted the wrong person. Why did you say you're gonna clap these? Girls I met at the bar's cheeks whoop whoop mean. Dude, no. fuck your ex girlfriend. Well, yeah, fuck her. I'm not dating her anymore. I, I broke up with her because she said your voice sounded so bad. So I said I can't. I can't what? Yo, fuck that. Oh, uh, what you talking about? You talking about my voice sounds bad? What you mean? You have that deep, manly voice, and I guess some women. She couldn't handle the testosterone. <laughs> testosterone. Yeah, dude, great donation streaks. Thank you, dog. <laughs> Alright, yo, homie. You already got the spot after this? Like, you, uh. Nah, I'm. I don't know, I'm gonna go walk, or go walk somewhere. Like, I can, I can show you places that are open if you want. You know? Yeah, let's go. I'm trying to do your own thing. Like, I can bail. I don't know if, like, I don't know if, like, chat is totally hating me right now. No, but... they don't hate you, bro. Yeah, okay. Let's get out of here. Yeah, man. Yeah, let's... Yeah, let's go. Bye bye, guys. Nice seeing you guys. You look like Marie. Straight the fuck up. Hey, hey, you know what? Marie's a good looking girl. So you got a lot going for you. What's up? What? What's her name's Marie. Marie. Marie from France. Playboy. Yeah, add her on Instagram. She got hella followers. She's good as fuck. Dang. Dang shit. What? Uh, I don't know how to spell her last name. Marie Bur Bernie Sanders, or I don't know something. <laughs> is he? Yeah. Bernie Sanders is dead, bro. What do you mean? He got a fucking heart attack. No way, dude. Yeah. Bro, that motherfucker wants to be president, bro. He's dead already. What do you mean? Yeah, they they suicided him. Maybe. No, they didn't. <laughs> what you talking about? That's crazy. Is he really? That's crazy. He is in the hospital, for real. Damn, son. Oh, Marie BX. BX. Marie BX. Marie Breathe Knox. Breathe Knox. I don't know. Just type in Marie the Playboy model. She's my friend. She dope as fuck. Gang. Goodbye. Bernie, the, well, Bernie, he can't be president if he's going to the hospital and shit, dude. Come on, kind of, come on, dog. You got to be a strong male to be president, homie. Dude, fuck. Alright. You don't understand what they were saying? No, no, no. So the thing is, is like, I'm able to survive with my shit, but when people talk to me, it's fast. They don't know that I'm retarded. It's really, really easy if you just knock and say yes. They continue talking to you because they think you understand. But then you get lost in the conversation. Yeah, yeah. So then I just kind of awkwardly sit there and they ask me a question and I'm like, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Just say anything. Yeah, right. So where have you already been? Cause like, I feel like you walk around the same place. Yeah, I've been everywhere, dude. In Prague One, to, okay. to be honest. I, I told you we should go to Jupiter. 
So I live in Zhiskov, and the places over there that are probably open later over here, everything's expensive. You know? What is Zhiskov? Zhiskov is like, there's different, yeah, there's different districts. Every district has a name. So you think there's different problems. I mean, it's kind of. Right? Yeah, but it's I mean, I'm not. City. I'm not trying to go like hella far though. No, no. no. So I mean, do you have a, a transportation ticket? Or are you just oh. solely on? Bro, foot? I have been going on the trams for free. Okay. Not paying for shit. <laughs> okay, because if you continue doing that, it's like 15 minutes on the tram. So if there's no Uber, there's no taxi, there's no money. Just get on. 15 minutes, you get off, and you're in the the neighborhood. You know. And there's a lot better, there's a lot better places than there are here. Oh yeah, like more like, uh, like what? Go to Toodle Noodle. What is that? Like Toodly Noodly. <laughs> what, and what's over there? Uh, it's like a smoking bar. A smoking bar, yeah. huh? There's another place that's like a You haven't had a bar. cigarette in fucking, you know, you Shane smoked while you had your fucking... Like, yeah, I smoked my, I smoked my three cigarettes, I've had one all day, bro. <laughs> Hey, I, I'm not really, I'm not addicted to cigarettes or anything, dude. I just like, you know, if I have this, if I have the time, I like smoking yeah, one. Yeah. You know? And now you don't have the jewel as well, right? No, I, I prefer to, I don't even like cigarettes. They taste like shit. And they smell like shit. And they make me. You always buy them in. They make me throw up. No, those are gross. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I <laughs> much prefer the jewel. I don't know how cigarettes are a thing, but I, I miss my jewel, bro. All the, all the jewels here, yep. they have like no nicotine. Well, how many different types of uh, like vapes are there? Because I I know like I've heard of the Jewel, but I don't know what all the brands are. So the thing like, is, the why vapes is the Jewel here? so good? The Jewel the vapes here are like because in America the Jewel has like a lot of nicotine, like you get a head it's like, like to a, buy a, a, a pack shitload. Of cigarettes, right? Yeah, it's like a one Jewel pot is a whole pack of cigarettes. Yeah. Uh, worth but the here nicotine. people buy like these fucking you know high tech vapes. You know before Jewel came, yeah, we had the normal ones where you have to build it yourself. That's bullshit. But I like Jewel because it's that's, all. That's what about what about the one where it's a little filter and you put it in the cigarette and it doesn't yeah, burn equal. the cigarette but it like yeah, cooks it, it, it vaporizes it. I don't know. That's, is that what it's it, yeah, it sounds it's like a, some dog shit to me. It's a cigarette vape. Probably is. You know a, a weed vape? It's a cigarette vape. That's off. What, what's the point of that? That's stupid. It's, it's more natural. It's healthy for you. It's, healthy, healthy, it's, it's not healthy. It's healthy. healthy. Yeah, it's healthy. Man. Uh, dude, I'd rather just smoke a jewel, get fucked up on it, and I'm good. You ever smoke resin? <laughs> what? Resin? No. Dude, what do you mean resin? Dude, resin, dude? Like what? Tobacco <laughs> resin? Dude? No, no, like Cigarette resin? resin? No. When you when you want to smoke, and then you have a pipe that's really dirty, and then you scrape out all the resin that's collected because you never clean your bowl. Oh yeah. Not you, me. When I never clean my bowl. I mean, I've smoked resin before. Yeah, in Florida when it was illegal. Legal? Yeah, I have. I smoke toilet disgusting? weed as well. Toilet. Does it work from the toilet? Yeah, it's my, it does. It does work, but it takes. Better. My mom tried to flush the toilet or flush the weed in the toilet, and it didn't work. And I went in the toilet and I I, I snaked it out. Yeah. And then I smoked yeah, it. Awesome. Yeah, the wet weed that was like in the drain <laughs> of the toilet. <laughs> and you know what? It still got me high, so I'm okay. Dude, when I was in well, middle like, school, they used to say you could like take a shit in a mason jar, bury it in the ground, and then yeah, after yeah, two yeah, weeks, yeah, 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 yeah. it's like that Jenkins shit. Like yeah, you could yeah, just what? Like, huff Fucking your own yeah. fermented shit fumes yeah, yeah. and get high off. No, bro, did you do that? I didn't do it. Africa, no, no, bro. Totally imagine huffing your own Africa. shit to get high. What kind of crackhead do you have to be? Huffing, man. I mean. No, that's some crackhead shit, homie. Dude, it always, you know. What you mean? I didn't do it. I didn't do it, but I heard about it. Bro, that's some real Florida shit, for real. Yeah, yeah. Greeting from Brazuki. Glad to finally see you in Chucky at 20. Yeah. Bro, greetings from Brazuki. What is that? Hey, thank you, dude. Canadian gaming. How many do you have? Three. Here, what do you have? Three? Perfect. What, yeah, sure. What is it? You want a beer? Like, a beer? Away? No. Oh, no, I'm good. I'm, I'm good on that. How much tech do you know? We can give you some survival tech to pick up all the ladies, man. I mean, it's my last name, check, so uh, yeah. Well, now you can say it and not be afraid of, uh, you know, someone slapping you because you're going to leave the country. Well, what's uh, what's some good survival check? Yeah, so if you want to tell a girl Evil, that she's, she's really word. beautiful, you say... I would never say that. Okay, what do you want to say? I have a girlfriend. Alright, what do you want to say? Uh, a nice compliment, something respectful. What do you want to? He wants to say, "I have a girlfriend," right? I want to say, "Stop flirting on me. I have a girlfriend." Because they all try to fuck me. I don't know why. Say, uh, I'd say, I want to. I don't want to fuck you. How do I say that? I don't want to fuck you. <laughs> I gotta think about that. I don't usually say that, so I gotta think about how to. Let's see. Uh, next, see, it's a boy Kochichka. 
Mexi Tavoy Chatiska. I don't want your pussy. I don't know. I don't want your pussy. Mexi Tavoy Kotichka. What do you mean, bro? Kotichka is literally cat, so you say, I don't want your pussy. I don't want your cat. I don't want your pussy. There's probably a better way to say it. How do you say it again? Mexi is like, I don't want. Mexi? Neck, like neck. Neck. And then C. C. Mexi Tavoy. Tavoy. Kochichka. Kochi Nexki Tovoy Chachiska. Are there any people in there? Can you verify this? Verify that this is like a correct translation. Yeah, dude, I'm not gonna remember that There's gotta whatsoever. There's going people in the stream right now, right? I am not gonna remember Someone's that. Someone's gonna say that that's actually like not bad pronunciation. That's yeah, heavy. it doesn't matter. Zero chance I remember anything you just said. The Czech language is too difficult for my brain. Yeah, it is. It is pretty hard. I don't know how you learned it, but. It is what it is. I mean, even if you're totally bad with languages, I mean, if you live anywhere long enough, it's just kind of a matter of time, you know? But did you study for it, or did you Yeah, no, it? I, I studied for it. I was reading a Czech girl who spoke a lot. Yeah, I can. I can. Oh, and she spoke I English, too? Well, yeah. I no, mean, only Czech. That's why it worked. Uh. <laughs> but I was going to say, in Sweden, you guys have the crazy laws with alcohol. You have to go to the special government shop, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. What yeah, the yeah. fuck do you mean? It's, it's no, kind of no late. Potramini. Right? Special government shop. Yeah, yeah. The only the only shop you can buy alcohol over three point five percent is government. It's run by the government. Why? So if you want to get like it's proper like beer or, or like alcohol, then you have to go to the. And they close at like seven. Why is that a thing? I don't know. I don't know. Communism. That's some weird ass <laughs> shit, bro. What you mean? And close on Sundays. On Saturdays, only open until three. Do you stay in Bilal yet? How many times have you walked on this street before? Uh, well, my hotel's right here, so every day. I told him we could go for a hotel. Man. It was only like $90, or no, it was, it was $80. Yeah, I'm kind of hungry right now. Can we go to this fucking boulevard place? There's a, yeah, there's KFC and a boulevard. Yeah, let's go to the boulevard. I want to show the chat the most dankest fucking fast food check place I've ever like seen. You haven't had that get boulevard? I have. Which one did you get? Which this sandwich? one. The, I don't know which, like, which bag the ham and cheese. It's dank as fuck. It's cheap as fuck and it's dank as fuck. Yo, this, it's like a check. Yo. The, the boulevard thing is like, it's a check one, yeah? It's like a check sort of place. It's like check subway. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, dude, this place. You can't give any uh, special requests. You get it as it is. You yeah. can't. Like... I know, but it's dank. That's what I'm. It's dank as fuck. You see them make it for it's you, so bro. good, dude. It's made in the back with some sweaty person, but it tastes good. It tastes really good. It don't matter to me, bro. Chad, this place, fucking, literally Subway and Chuck, fries, but it's fries so are good. good too, man. They have these like potato wedges with tartar sauce. I know. This shit's like a uh, chain, yeah. Yeah. Bro, it's the best fucking fast food I've ever had. Ahoy! Ahoy! Yo, I'm Czech, what's up? Okay. No, I'm not. Yo, can I get a ham and cheese? Ham and cheese? I got it. Yeah. Warm or uh, fresh? Sorry? Warm or fresh? Warm or fresh? Baked or no baguette? Baked baguette or no baguette? Oh yeah, baguette. Baguette. Yeah, yeah. That's it? Yeah. Uh, is there ice uh, no, yeah, just, just, no, just the, just the baguette. Just, just the, the just the, just the baguette. So, I don't need four cars. Look at that, hundred four dollars. It's so fucking for the best thing in the world. Best thing in the world. Here's two hundred. Are you Czech? No. Where are you from? Vietnam. What's it all the Vietnamese around here? Everyone's Vietnam around this motherfucker. Let's go. Thank you. Yeah, where are these guys at? Yo, y'all gonna y'all gonna come inside? Yeah. Okay, yeah, we're gonna drink these. Alright. Yo chat, this place is dank as fuck. It's just the, literally the best fast food I've ever had. Like, it's just so it's like a Panera bread mixed with a subway. It's so fucking good. And it's fucking only in Czech Republic, I, I guess. Like, it's ridiculous. I'm number 96. They have a timer and everything. It's crazy. 
And it's cheap as fuck, and all the fries have mayonnaise on it. It's amazing. Yeah, man. Gang. Sorry. $104 for it, it's $10. Dude, it's 100 fucking check money is $4. What are you talking about? What time is it there? It is 9.30. 9.40. It's it's late, but I know in America, what is it? In, in Austin right now, it is what? One o'clock in the afternoon, and then like 11 a.m. in LA? Something like that. It's 2.30, all right. 2.30, it's not bad. Three thirty in Ontario. Well, nobody, nobody lives in Ontario, so it's fine. Oh, that's me. Hello. Good appetite, man. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. There are student parties you can go to in Prague on Wednesday. Well, I don't see any students on this round, so I guess so. Amazing. Look at this. Better than public subs, better than Subway, better than Chick-fil-A, better than Panera Bread, better than any. This is the best fast food I've ever had in my life. The bread is is so fresh. And the meat is so good. Wow. Wow, and for only four dollars, wow. Holy fuck. Laughing at me? What can you what laughing at what? My charisma? What's up? I just want a conversation. I have a girlfriend. Gang shit. It's not a bread and lettuce sandwich, it's got ham in it. Ham and cheese, dude.
I used to never have content while I was in relationships. Do you understand that? Bro, I had, <clears throat> I don't need to talk to girls and have, like, sexual relationships with them and have content. What do you mean? By the way, ladies, have a girlfriend to fuck you. No, that's not what I'm saying. But I just wanted to have a conversation, that's all. I just wanted to have a normal conversation where they fall in love with me and I say no. That's all. Turn the stream on, you're sitting and eating. <laughs> what do you know? The new wave. Just have a normal talk with them. It's not really normal to walk up to them in a restaurant, though. Hello. How is your day going? Are you also from Vietnam? Are you also from Vietnam? Where are you from? Russia. Moscow. No way. You're really from Moscow? You're born in Moscow. I'm American. Listen. I know our countries don't fuck with each other, but our but our conversation will fuck with each other. <laughs> you know, Donald Trump and Vladimir Putin, number one, they like this. Paul, what's your name? Vivi. Vivi? Nice to see you, Vivi. And what are you guys doing tonight? <laughs> Don't worry, I have a girlfriend. Don't worry, I have terrible hair. <laughs> good, good, good. She just died in front of her. I'm just having a conversation. So what are you doing later? Uh, I'm going to be because my work. Quit your job. No, I don't. Hang out with me. I can't. <laughs> Why? Because I should make money. <laughs> I'll give you money. No thanks. <laughs> I will make it by myself. You're a real independent woman. I am truly independent. But honestly, I would give you money just to hang out with me. No thanks. For free. No thanks. Nothing in return. I know. No thank you. I have a boyfriend. Oh, so I know. I have a girlfriend. Okay, then, but I can't. Thank you. I just have no friends. I just, I just want friends. That's all. I have no friends. I don't know. I'm in the Czech Republic by myself. I don't know. Because I'm a loser. But I have no friends. Sorry? No. They're my... Brothers. Brothers? Yeah. It's like a friend. It's my sister. <laughs> yeah, but brother, sister, it's just it's different. I don't know. Never mind. Okay, goodbye. goodbye. I'm going to sit back over here and eat this bread.
I'm not winning in the money, obviously. What do you mean? She thinks she's about to be kidnapped. No. I was just trying to have a conversation. What do you mean? I don't get why is that cringe? I don't think cringe about it. This is a conversation, dude. That's some good ass shit, bro. Yo, you just like spilled lettuce all over the table. Man. <laughs> That's dessert. It ain't easy being this good. Cheesy? It ain't easy being cheesy. It's true. Do you remember that commercial? Oh. Cheetos. Cheetos, yeah. Is there a bathroom? Yeah, but there's like some code, I think. Who's piss on the shirt? Have you done that? Like, how have you been dealing with having to pee? Because for a foreigner, just on the street, outside? Yeah. Uh, I pee on the street or my hotel? The yeah, hotel is probably the best. But on the street, like, people do it, but there's, there's like, there's an etiquette about it. So. What is it? So, for example, on the street that I live on, I was coming home one day, it was like 2 o'clock in the afternoon, broad daylight. And there's a guy just pissing on the side of a wall for this apartment building. And I'm thinking, like, there's a park one block away. If it's broad daylight, I don't think it's proper etiquette to just take a piss right there where people are walking by. Now, if you're, if you're out drinking and you're in the center, maybe you find a spot where there isn't a lot of traffic, in between some cars, by a bush, you know, some type of nature, piss over there. People will understand. But it's a little... Uh, Broad daylight, I don't know. Have you ever pissed in broad daylight before? I've taken a shit in broad daylight. broad daylight. I shit myself in broad daylight, but I didn't do it on purpose. I got it on my shirt, too, man. It's like, somehow it splashed on me. It was diarrhea. It was really bad. I was going to teach an English lesson. And I, you ever do, like, when you have to shit and there's this penguin walk when you're clenching your ass cheeks so tight together that you can't fully walk right? And, uh, no, I just shit. Yeah. I just shit on the road. No, you had to shit, and you, you were like, I'm going to take a shit. It was a conscious decision that you are going to do it, right? I just shit myself. There was no control. No, it's shit on the it road. projectile. Just take your pants off and shit in the road. Yeah. It's like a free bathroom? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I got no code. How did it go with the girls? Awful. <laughs> they hate me. Everyone hates me around here. You're American? No, because I bother them and walk up and try to have a conversation in the middle of a fucking fast food restaurant. So they hate me. <laughs> Everyone hates you everywhere. I know, dude. So I mean, you got sneak stream snipers, obviously not. I uh, maybe. Yeah, fuck, dude. If I, I don't know, fucking. If somebody walked up to me at McDonald's and tried to talk to me, I'd be like, who the fuck's this guy? Why is he talking to me? You fucking weirdo. Why is he filming? Yeah, why is he fucking <laughs> filming me? Same thing. So it's like, now I'm on the other side. It's like, I'm a fucking weirdo. Thank you for a 10, I appreciate that, homie. You yeah, this first introspection. No, I get it. That's why I don't point the camera at people as much anymore. Because I am self-aware that it is fucking obnoxious to be recorded when you are just chilling. So I point the camera at myself you nowadays. Yeah. You just got a bottle of champagne and just brought it in and just drink it again. Why not? It's classic. It's a fancy place. I wonder what sandwich goes with a bottle of champagne. I don't know if the ham and cheese cuts it, you know? You gotta get Probably something like the Caesar. Caesar. The salmon. salmon? I don't know. I don't know. Yeah. Caesar. Caesar, Caesar baguette on the dark bread. No, that's too cheap. 
No, I like the ham and cheese, dog. I don't really want to go so far to the place, though. We can go walking distance. We can try Usudu. It's walking distance. I'm already like, like, I'm already like kind of don't yeah. really want any more beer. No, we don't have to drink, man. I mean, uh, well, I do. Yeah, I kind of do too. <laughs> when, once you leave here, then you always have to drink. I mean, do you want to talk to homeless people or? No, I don't want to talk to any fucking homeless people. He dude. does that enough in LA. There's, I didn't come to Prague to, get to talk to homeless people, dog. Because <laughs> I'm trying to say, if you don't want to drink, it's totally understandable. But but do you have any type of like thing where it's like, oh fuck, I got to do this in Prague and it doesn't involve alcohol? We can try to help you find that. You know? Did you go to the honors store? I don't. I don't know. I think I've done everything in Prague that I want. I mean, there's not really shit to do in Prague. What do you mean? Well, you, you said you've There's, only been in Old Town, right? And Prague is yeah, like pretty big. Yeah, but not in Prague, right? Yes. There is, though. If you, if you go out of Prague, of Prague 1, then yeah. Shishko. Like, there's the castle. Did you go to Prague Castle? No. Not on stream. No. But, like, Austrian, it's fucking did you go? raining every day. Yeah, that's, that's true. Did you go to Charles Bridge? Uh, yeah, I did. You did? Okay. Uh, Vishadad's far away. That's another yeah. castle, too. Waking while like, did you already walk down this street over here? Yeah, that goes all the way to the West yeah. Kaiser Square. So let's let's walk by Usudu, see what it's like, and then there's that park, and maybe there's some cool some cool junkies we can hang out with. Some cool junkies? Some cool junkies, yeah. Bro, I'm not trying to hang out with no junkies, dog. We're talking about. Yeah, what do you think? Yeah, like, I don't want to get you fucked up and, like, drunk and stuff, but I feel like that's a huge part of... Yeah, of that's just, what you do here. It's like, kind of like going to a bar or, or going, uh, drinking something. I mean, I have, I have weed, too, but I don't have any papers. And I actually quit smoking. We can get papers. But, yeah. You don't want to smoke on stream, though, right? Yeah, so... Not really. Never mind. I'll give it to you. You can have it for your I mean, personal... I've been, personal I've been drinking, like, way... I've been drinking for the past week, dude. Is that hard to be... When you're streaming and, like, people meet you, and maybe for me, I don't drink every day, but if I meet Ice Beside and I'm going to say, oh, let's go drink, but that's every encounter that you have, Bruh, right? I'm, I've been drinking every day for, <laughs> so, like, like... Every time you meet somebody, they want to get you a drink. Either that or weed. Okay, let's drink. I know. Every, I'm, not, I'm always fucked up it's on something, dude. It's... It's very exhausting, cause like I don't really drink that much off stream. So then, when it's like when I travel, it's like I'm drinking every fucking day. It's like gosh. Well, you're on vacation, so you have to, right? Yeah, but it 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 drains you. You know what I mean? Yeah. There's yeah. the I'm trying to think. There's like the Sex Machine Museum that's probably closed by now. My phone's dead, but I'm. I went to, to the like, Sex Museum. Yeah. How was it? It had no internet. Okay. Unfortunately. So, it's not. It's not good. There's also the. Uh, Can I have one of those? Cigarettes? Yeah. Yeah, you I gotta, smoke yours already? Yeah, I gotta get off my... Off stream? Yeah, yeah, no, on stream. <laughs> gotta get no, you my... you wanna smoke tree, so... Do yeah. you use the push ones? Have you seen those before? What's that? The little flavor bubble. I think they, they banned those, no? Uh, you smell not like here. No? In Sweden, they do. So, so they, they still Wait, what is that? The same shit What's a flavor the... bubble? So, look at the filter on that cigarette. No, no, that, well, that's, that's a normal. A, that's a normal. Okay, so, on the filter, there would be some little packet, like a flavor packet. And you pop it, and it could be blueberry, it could be grape, it could be some flavor. And it just adds something, I don't know what the chemicals are, but it adds some flavor chemicals. It yeah. makes it taste like... It's just more chemicals. Yeah. Oh, it's just more, more chemicals in your lungs, <laughs> yeah. so well, perfect. You're already getting plenty, so why not? Yeah, I, we got plenty of chemicals here, no need for more, How dude. How much worse could it be? You know, you add a couple Yeah, I think more. the chat's saying it, it's like the one, the menthol. Yeah, yeah. Where you crush it and it's like more menthol-y. Well, that, that flavor too, but there's also like, I saw like a grape one. And some of them have two bubbles. And you can mix and match or you can do both. And you know Thank you, Mike, for the uh, sponsor, dude. Because they banned, in Sweden they banned, so you can't click it, but they can still have, you know, the filters can be... Yeah. Uh, so, what Camel did was, they made a cigarette with tobacco paper, because then it's not a cigarette anymore, it's a cigarillo. Yeah, yeah. But cigarillo? They, That's like a cigar. Yeah, but with tobacco, with, with normal cigarette tobacco. So you could still click it, and it would taste like Ruger, because it wasn't a cigarette, it was more like a, a cigarette. So it's not the, the flavor bubble, it's the fact that it's connected to a cigarette. So if you have the same chemicals, but in a different No, but, but okay. it's only banned in cigarettes, but yeah. not yeah, in yeah, cigarillos. Yeah, yeah. So as long as... CX in the chat. ...tobacco around the tobacco, Thank you, Mike. then it's not a cigarette. Fuck yeah. So then, so they sold it in normal packages. It was just that it was tobacco instead of paper. Really? Those are smart people. Talking about the good old stogies. I bet they made a lot of money. Just loopholes for days, yeah. you know?
Have you been scammed since you've been here so far? Anyone come up to you? Oh yeah, every time I exchange my money, I get fucking scammed. Where did you exchange money? Because every yeah, one of these, every, yeah. one of these zero percent fucking bullshit places. <laughs> Has anyone come up to you trying to exchange money on the street? I would never. Fuck no. No. Hell you no. wouldn't do it for the content. You wouldn't. You wouldn't. I would not engage in some fucking lose forty dollars for the content for no reason. Fuck no. Did you meet Anna's guide yet? No. Where's he at? I don't know. Probably sleeping. I, I tried looking for his Twitter, I couldn't find it. Oh, his Twitter's in check, I think. Fucking check, dude. <laughs> his name's Hanza, right? Or Jan? No, oh, Hanza is, is the camera. Oh, it's, his, name's his name is uh, Janik. But isn't Yannick, that's like the same as Hanza? Hanza's like the nickname. I, 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 I mean, it's a, it's I think it's Yannick and Hanza. I, I so if you're going to look him up, I wonder what his like name would be. Probably yeah. just on his guy. <coughs> that would be smart. I'm, so, I'm prob- if you looked, it wasn't a good search. Uh, yeah, I mean, I guess not. We're well, leaving anyway. It doesn't really. I, I seriously doubt. You know, he's gonna come out. Maybe he knows you. You never know. <laughs> <laughs> he's like, fuck yeah, I'm coming out. Yeah, I'm probably gonna go my own way, anyways. Yeah. I really like meeting you guys, though. Yeah, dude. Honestly, you guys Safe are, travels you guys, for the rest of your. Tra- yeah. How long in general are you gonna travel? Don't. For? Probably for another. Couple a uh, week, I don't know. Okay, well, we'll see it for a while. I probably, maybe not. I don't know. It depends on how I feel. <laughs> All right. It's nice seeing you guys. You guys are cool as fuck. Yeah, it's nice seeing another American. I was, yeah. You're very rare to come by. There's a lot of Americans here, but you know, really, I just seen shit. Yeah. But they're all in Chicago. They, they all hang out together. So. Yeah, that's, that's the reason why then. But nice seeing you guys. I'll see y'all later. See you, or, if you ever come back, then just let me know. Probably not for a while. Never. <laughs> maybe. I don't know. I like. I'll probably come back. Next time. I'll probably come when I'm like 75. Yeah, to retire. Drink some cocktails yeah, yeah, with yeah. my wife Fuck or something well. at the castle or something. <laughs> but yeah, I'll see you guys. Thanks. Right. For, thanks for showing me around. Thank you. Know, you showed me a good ass bar. I like that. And then you're cool as fuck. Do you want that glass with the half-eaten bread in it? I have nowhere to put it. Alright. You want to smash it? Smash it. Oh yeah, I'll smash it. Is that littering though? Yeah, no, it's totally. No, actually, it's a bad idea. Don't smash it. We can throw it in the river. It's just here. What you mean, dog? I'm not throwing The sh- river is just here. I'm it's not doing that on stream. I'm. Give, someone's gonna say it's I'm littering, idea. bro. They're gonna call the cops on me. Yeah. Okay. Alright, last handshake. Right. This is like the fifth yeah. one. Alright, All right. see you later, man. Later, guys. Bye bye. Bye. See ya. I'm gonna go this way. I gotta fucking pee so fucking bad. Let me out. I gotta pee again, bro. That fucking beer goes right through me. My hotel's like right over here, so I'm just gonna pee real quick in my hotel. And I'm gonna show you guys the room that I got. Dude, it's literally. Just, the room I paid for is $90 today. It's fucking expensive. Well, not really, but. I mean, $90 compared, relatively speaking, to like the other rooms. My other hotel was right there. It was $60. It's was, it was fucking nice. But then today it was $120, so I'm like, right, I'm just gonna check out. Because why would I do $120 when the hotel across the street is $90 fucking dollars? Gang, why did you do that? Ah, dude, I, I drink three beers. I'm feeling pretty like whew, pretty good right now. I don't know. Bed bugs? Nah, not at all, dude. No bed bugs. Yeah, I'm gonna go to Poland tomorrow. Go to, I guess, Krakow. I mean, I'm gonna look up the the trains and see like what's cheaper, Krakow or Vienna or whatever. So I don't know what's cheaper. I think the train is, is, I think the train might be more expensive than Krakow, but it'd be cheaper there, you know? So we'll check it out. People say go to Krakow, hopefully it's good there. He says everything's underground though. So hopefully I can find some shit to do that's not underground, you know? Because there's not going to be any internet underground. Ten hour train to Krakow? Is it? I thought it was like four hours away. What do you mean ten hours, dude? It's like four hours to go to Poland. We're right next to Poland, dude. I got a piece so fucking bad. Who the fuck's my hotel? I think it's right here. Am I going to Denmark? Uh, I don't know. Not uh, right now. <laughs> Maybe one day.
Oh, dude, we've been live for like six hours now. Pretty good. Come to Georgia, dude. That's like the Middle East. <laughs> Georgia's far as fuck, dude. I gotta pee so bad. Hold on. My hotel's like right here, though. One sec. Let me just do this for a second. Alright, one second chat, let me pee. Look at this. $98, bro. Look at this. Good as fuck. Got this whole little area. $98 hotel. It's easy. Look at that. Great bathroom. Great. Got a separate room here. The beds, the window. Look at that shit. We got all this. $90. It's pretty good shit, not gonna lie. get a train to, to Poland tomorrow. So, we'll see how Poland is, I guess. I'll look up some trains to see what's cheaper. To Poland or Austria. Whichever one is cheaper, we'll go there. But I'm going to end the stream, dude. That's, uh, we've been streaming for like six hours now. I'm fucking... A little drunk and I'm tired, so I'm gonna end the stream. We'll go to Poland tomorrow and uh, get out of Prague, see what's going on over there. Going to Krakow in Poland, so we'll see, uh, we'll see what's happening. But I thank you guys for watching. I appreciate you guys very much. I hope you guys enjoyed. The cheapness of Czech really showed you how cheap everything was. Obviously, um, I think if we go to Poland, it'll be way cheaper, and it'll, we'll see what we can get. I'll do like a like a twenty dollar challenge. What we can get for twenty dollars in Poland? That would be good. Well, thank you all for watching. And I will see you guys tomorrow. Uh, I'm about to wake up early and stream. If there's internet on the train, I'll stream a little bit on the train. If there's internet on it. Otherwise, then I'll stream when we get to Krakow. We'll probably be in Krakow for like two days or something. And then go from there and see what's going on.
but yeah, I'll, thanks, thank you guys for watching, I'll see y'all tomorrow, and uh, love you guys, peace out, and I will see you later, goodbye everybody, peace, I'll see you tomorrow. This is still what I have. It's like 600 euros left. So, it's a good amount. Bro, you can get for a throw. A thousand dollars can get you so far in, your, in East Europe. Holy fuck. How's it going, homie? It's good. I'm chilling, bro. How you doing? Like a thousand dollars can get you very far in East Europe. West Europe, not shit. East Europe, bro. It's, everything is so fucking cheap. No, I'm not going to do a sleep stream, but thank you. All right, I'm going to see you all tomorrow. All right, peace, guys, and see you soon. Later. Hope you guys enjoyed the early stream.